Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I have a, another Sheen haul to share with you. I uh, couldn't help myself after the last one. I loved a lot of the stuff that I got last time, so I just couldn't help myself, so I made another purchase. Um, that's all I'm gonna say. We're just gonna get straight back into the clothes, so here's the first one. Okay, so this is the Sheen Notch Neck Tie-Dye Tank Top and Runner Shorts Set. Um, as you can see with the picture, it's actually a little bit more pastel or maybe duller as you can see. But when I received it, it's actually a lot more vibrant, which I actually really enjoy. I really like the vibrant colours, I wouldn't have minded either, I like the pastel. I was kind of expecting the shorts to be a little shorter, but it's fine because they actually fit around my waist, which is really nice. And they, they still do fit nice, um, which is very good. Very soft, the, the material of the top is very soft, uh, the shorts are not as soft, but I wouldn't say they're like rough or itchy or anything. Very nice set, I absolutely love it. So this set should have been £7.49, I managed to grab it for £5.73, so for £7.50, yes, you get a top and a pair of shorts, what's not to like about that? Very comfy set. Uh, the material is, is nice and thick as well, if that's what you like. Not too thick, but not like see-through thin, so I really like that. Okay, these are the Sheen Wide Waistband Runner Shorts. Now, how am I supposed to wear these? Are these supposed to be low-rise or high-waisted? Because as you can see, I'm having a few problems with them. So when they're low-rise, they're incredibly baggy. But if I pull them up, they're really high up. So I don't actually know how I'm supposed to wear them because as you can see on the picture, there's not actually a model wearing it. Are these supposed to be high-waisted or low-rise? I don't even think I like them either way. I'm not 100% sure how I'm supposed to wear these. Confusing piece that I've bought. I cannot decide how I'm supposed to wear these shorts properly because I looked at the reviews and all the people wearing them, they look good. They were rocking them, you know, but it's just... They didn't look how they looked on me, so I'm like, what? <laughs> Maybe they're supposed to be like that. I'm not sure. Uh, these were supposed to be £4. I got them for £3.07. £4 for a pair of shorts. Yeah, that's good. Um, How I feel about these particular shorts? I'm not sure yet. The back looks good. The front, not so much. Maybe I just need to wear them. Maybe they're just out of my comfort zone. Maybe... Okay, so this is the Floral and Animal print t-shirt. Now the first thing I have to say about this is it feels stiff. Not tight, but just like there's no give, there's no stretch. There's a little bit of stretch, but it just feels... It feels like it needs a wash. It might just need a wash, but uh, it definitely is a thicker material than most t-shirts, I would say right off the bat. This t-shirt should have been £7.50. I got it for £2.68. Wow. £7.50 is actually not that bad for a t-shirt, honestly. But uh, £2.68? Definitely. And also, I bought all my clothes in extra small. This seems very big for an extra small. Overall, it's still, it's still pretty good. It's still comfy, you know, it's not itchy. You know, it's relatively soft, smoothish. It's just the material's a bit tight-fitting, that's all. Okay, so this is the Dragonfly Print Crew Neck T-shirt. Now this one was so much softer than the last one. This one does feel like a normal T-shirt, but it's kind of like a... even smoother. It's kind of like a shiny material, but it's very soft. And this one is smaller fit than the previous one, so this one fits me a lot better. It's a shorter T-shirt as well, but uh, still the, the pattern is pretty much the same in the picture. And it's a very nice fit. I do like this t-shirt overall. Incredibly comfy and soft. Um, so this one was £7.50. Whereas I got it for £3.07. £7.50 for a t-shirt still isn't bad. Even like I said before. £3.07. Even better. That is an incredibly good price for this t-shirt I think. Okay as you can see this is the solid notch neck t-shirt. Uh, first thing that I want to say is that it's very loose around the shoulders. wasn't expecting that. It's nice fitting around my waist, but it's very loose around the shoulders. It's also very see-through. I uh, 
had to put a bra on for this one. Uh, I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to, but uh, <laughs> it's very see-through, which it isn't in the pictures. So I was very surprised. It, it's still cute. Um, it's still wearable. It's still a very soft-ish material. It's kind of like ribbed. So this should have been £6, whereas I got it for £3.45. I mean, £6 is still not bad for that, but £3.45, yeah, sure. I mean, I don't think I would buy another one. Maybe I'd be more inclined to buy it in like a dark colour, so that maybe it'd be not as see-through. Okay, so this is the floral print cami top in black. Now you've got a lot of colours to choose from in this one, but I chose black. Really nice, really soft, really, really light. Uh, this one is, this one I'd love to be able to wear like in the summer or maybe even the spring, but the material is really soft. Uh, you do have adjustable straps on the back as well, so you can make them shorter or longer, which I really liked and wasn't actually expecting, but I thought that was really cute. So I could make them shorter if I wanted, which I might do. So this should have been £6. I got it for £3.07. So it's actually, I think that's really good for £6. Uh, I've actually paid £6 for this. Um, I always sent away for the sales anyway, but if I, if, you know, if I had the money, I'd pay £6 for this. But £3, half off? Yes, definitely. I'd get two. <laughs> okay, so this is the tie-dye twist hem crop t-shirt. Uh, this is so cute, so soft, and very comfortable. It obviously comes with a little tie at the front, uh, a nice crop top. It is so soft, and it's a little, for me personally, it's a little tight around the neck. I don't generally like tight fitting things around here, so it's, it was a bit like, ooh, for me at the beginning, but I've actually gotten used to it already, because it's not tight, obviously, as you can see, but it was a bit, it's a bit tighter than general t-shirts. But uh, I got used to it pretty fast. It's not tight around the arms at all. The only thing is, it's a bit more green than the picture. It's, the picture is slightly more light blue with a hint of green, whereas this just seems green. Um, I actually don't mind. I'm happy with it either way. Overall, really cute. Uh, this should have been £5. I got it for £1.92. £5? Yeah, sure. £1.92? Hell yeah. Either price I think is fair, honestly. So this is the twist front cropped cami top. Now I will admit, uh, the first time I put this on, I had to do kind of like some fixing, um, per se. Because when I first put on the top, the, the straps sit really weird. They sat like really here. So what I had to do was I had to really pull down the back in order to like straighten them up to get them to sit properly. Otherwise they kind of, they looked a little bit weird, um, but I managed to fix it. Overall, really soft material. Um, it's not like too thin either. It's a good thickness. Um, obviously, I'm not wearing a bra with this and I feel comfortable wearing this. Obviously, everybody's comfort levels are different, which is fine. But for me, this is great. Um, very soft, very comfy, very light. So this top should have been £5.50. I got it for £4.20. So, £5? Yeah, probably, actually. It's not it's not that bad of a price. £5.50? Uh, £4.20? Sure. It's really cute. Uh, <laughs> especially for, like, summertime. Pair it with a nice pair of shorts or maybe a skirt. You know? It's cute. I think that's worth the money. Okay, so this is the fruit print Rutchet front cami dress. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. Hopefully I am, but probably not. First thing that I want to say is... Wow, I fell in love with this dress as soon as I put it on. This is adorable. I feel so cute in it. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I don't really go for dresses like this. I usually go for like skin tight ones with like pencil skirt, you know. But this is really cute. I love it. Um, the material, one thing about the material is it's, there's very, very little stretch. It's almost not there. It's a strange material, I would say. So this, this was... £12.50, but I managed to grab it for £4.60. Even for £13, I think that's kind of okay. I think that's not that bad, actually. But uh, for £4.60, hell yeah. I was like, oh. I saw how much was off the dress and I was like, yes, please. So this is the floral print 
split hem cami dress. This, super cute. One thing, I definitely had to adjust the straps. Because before, this bit was all the way like down here. I'm not kidding. So I had to adjust it pretty much here. It's literally here. There's this much of a gap for me. Um, but after I adjusted it, fell in love. It is so cute. I probably would, for me, recommend wearing heels because it's pretty much floor length. Whereas in the picture, obviously she's taller than me. So it's not touching the floor, but for me, it touches the floor. So maybe I could wear this with a pair of heels. It, it's not heavy against the floor so maybe i can wear flats but for me i would like to lift it up a bit or lift me up a bit i should say so it's not dragging on the floor the material is slightly like a heavy material or maybe it's just because there's layers i'm not sure um again this one doesn't have much stretch in it it, it feels like the last dress and i don't know how to explain it it's kind of i want to say it's almost like silky but it's not silk <laughs> if that makes any difference. But I love it though. It, it's Even though it feels a little bit heavy, it's not like dragging me down heavy, you know? I think I, it's just, I can feel the layers and I can feel that it's a slightly thicker material. So this dress should have been 16 pounds 50 and I managed to grab it for six pounds 37. I pretty much got 10 pounds off. I saw this dress, I saw the discount, and I got a further discount as well. And I was like, I have to. Okay, so this is the plaid bodycon cami dress. Now I will say straight off the bat, I was not expecting the material that this dress was made out of. I honestly have no idea how to explain it, but it's like shiny, incredibly smooth. It's a bit like silk, but again, I don't think it's silk don't know what material it is but I was not expecting it I mean it's still nice it's not see-through whatsoever it fits really nice really soft it's not tight tight um there is no adjustable straps though so yeah, for me that was a bit uh oh but uh, it still fits really nice honestly so this dress should have been 10 pounds actually I paid three pounds 80 nice I like it 10 pounds yeah, sure. £3.80? Hell yeah. It's a really soft fit as well. It's not loose either. It fits nice and snug, which is really nice, which is what you want for these types of dresses. Um, I like it. A bit surprising, but I still like it and I uh, can't wait to wear it out. <laughs> and last, but certainly not least, we have the Sheen Surplus Neck Tartan Bodycon Dress. Hopefully I said that right as well. Now this is the material I was expecting from all of them. <laughs> This is, I don't know, fabric. <laughs> this is what I was expecting most of them to be though. Um, this one did have adjustable straps, which I'm very happy about because I needed to adjust them slightly. So I was able to do that and it fit much better for me. Uh, the material is nice and soft, um, it's stretchy enough, uh, but it holds its fit, which is very nice. I love it and the pattern's cute. This dress should have been five pounds. I grabbed it for £3.82. So that's not bad. As a £5 dress, honestly, yes anyway. £5 for a little dress like this? Cute. And there we have it. That is my Sheen haul for you guys. Um, really happy with pretty much everything in this bundle. Um, obviously there was a couple of things here and there for a few of the items. But overall, really happy with it. Um, I do have the, the one thing that I really do have to look into or just try on again maybe is those shorts. Um, let me know if you've bought them before and how they fit on you, whether I got like a bad pair or something, I'm not sure. Pretty much very happy with my order. So maybe I can do another haul for you guys, maybe sometime soon. I'm not sure. I've already been looking at the website again and honestly, there's still more that I could happily buy. But um, we'll see. So... I hope you have all enjoyed. I hope you found this interesting. Um, as always, I'll put everything needed in the description box below for everyone to see links, my sizes if you want a comparison. So I hope you have enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. So goodbye. <laughs>